Toy Story family. Okay, so today's mission is to fix Eden. If you guys don't know, we are currently at the dollhouse mansion. We accidentally let out seven of the creepy dolls around the mansion and we have to try to collect them but something weird is happening to Eden. Yeah, all of the dolls have super special powers and this one apparently had the power to turn Eden. <laughs> Maybe because we've been in the house so long, she's starting to turn, <gasps> wait, there she is. Into <gasps> a doll. Look at it, look at it. Oh no. Okay. Watch out, it's going to fall. Ophelia manages to scream. <gasps> Scary. <gasps> wait, she's reading the Ophelia book. Why, what is she doing? Hello, Eden. Oh! Oh. Hi. She follows you everywhere. Yeah, like you look. when you like move, she like follows you. Like, oh. That's kind of creepy. Guys, I don't know how we're supposed to turn her back into regular Eden. This isn't like anything we've dealt with before. Usually there's a doll that turns her into a doll, like Ophelia or Rosie, but this, I don't know what's happening. How did she even turn into the doll? Well, it was the end of Jack's poem. If you guys didn't see the last episode, Cole and Eden turned into Jack and Jill, but the end of the poem said Jill turns into a doll, and now this episode, she's a doll. Yeah, so you guys, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss anything, because there's just so much happening right now. <laughs> Wait, where's she going? She's going. Oh. What does she sound like that? Okay. Maybe we should go downstairs where all the other dolls were kept and see if we can find anything that can help us learn more about Eden or this doll or Jill, whoever she is. That's a good idea. Downstairs, there's a secret oh. uh, area where all the rest of the dolls are. Uh, oh, she's oh, okay. following. Go, 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 go. Okay. Hopefully she does not follow us. Oh. So down the stairs, there's so many stairs dollhouse mansion you guys we only found one of the seven dolls so far and that was jack in the last episode right so there are still six other dolls roaming the house hiding from us maybe there's something that will help us okay this is where the secret doll room is it's behind this bookshelf but every time we have to go into the room we have to answer the riddle for the statue back so oh. soon young traveler oh to be young and nimble Back in the day, I used to be quite the dancer, you know? i show you my moves, but I'm afraid I'm a bit rusty. Maybe you can help me by finding something I can put a little boogie into it. What does that mean? I don't know. Okay, there's always some sort of answer, and it's usually an object that we have to bring him back. So let's right. think about it. Okay. Uh, dance. No, he's a put a little boogie in it. Like boogie? No, like a booger. Boogie. Put a little boogie in it. A tissue. Oh. oh. Okay, so let's grab a tissue. Oh, okay. Whoa. Where'd that come from? Wait. Has that always been there? Maybe that's the tissue box? <gasps> oh, what was that? that? It says don't let her out. What does that mean? There's something in there. Don't let her out? Maybe it's like someone's pet. Don't let who out? I know, that's so weird. Okay, let's just find the tissue so we can get Eden back. I don't know. I feel like that was like, I don't know, someone's like goldfish or something. Yeah, uh, let's see if we have a tissue. Oh, Ophelia. Oh, wait, what's she doing in here? I have no idea. Oh, did you get it? Tissue? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay, hopefully that's it. Okay, Ophelia, uh, hopefully she's up to something that's helpful. Okay, and not creepy. Oh. <sighs> okay. Is it a tissue? Oh, it's working. It worked, it worked. Okay, okay. So these are the dolls that we have so far. There's Jack. And then all of the other cases are empty. And what's confusing, you guys, is we have seen what all of the dolls looks like. You guys saw in episode one. And Eden doesn't look like any of the dolls. So I don't think it's one of the dolls turning into Eden. I think this is something else we have to figure out. There has to be something we can use. Is there anything over here? Wait, guys. What? Look at it. What? This book. What is it? A Guide to Dolls. <gasps> I think this might be helpful for figuring out what happened to Eden. Okay, let's go back upstairs and find Eden. Okay, oh wait, there she is. What is she doing? Oh, good. Well, um, okay. I don't know what to say to that. Here now. Hi. Let's take a look inside this book okay. and see if there's something that will help us. There's okay. gotta be something in there that Whoa. can tell us more information. A ballerina doll? <gasps> what does that mean? I don't know. Wait, okay, okay. This is a list of all the different types of dolls. Okay. So maybe we could read through the different types of dolls and then see if any of them apply to Eden and then that'll help us out because this has like strengths, weaknesses, all these sort of things. Do you know what kind of doll you are? 
I wish. I just know that I'm a doll. Wow. Hey, that wasn't helpful. That was just as helpful as about the real Eden. Um, wait, listen to this. According to Doll Legend, most dolls can be categorized into four different types of dolls. The first type of doll is the creepy doll. The creepy doll? Yeah, okay, it says creepy dolls are one of the scariest types of dolls around. These are usually larger than the rest of the dolls. It's so like Ophelia and Rosie. Right, so I guess I'm gonna assume that those are creepy dolls. You guys have seen a lot of those on our channel. What are their characteristics? Creepy dolls are usually created by a doll maker of some sort. They're one of the oldest types of dolls and the scariest to deal with. I mean, this is technically his house. Right, that would definitely be Ophelia because we know Ophelia came from the doll maker. Are you from the doll maker? I don't know where I came from. That was helpful. It says that the strengths vary per doll, that they can be really different depending on the type of doll that it is, which we've definitely encountered. Some examples can be teleportation, mind control, and turning other people into dolls. <gasps> we've dealt with all of those with Ophelia and Rosie. It says, although the weaknesses vary per doll, older versions have a weakness to water, like Ophelia. Kind of like the iPhone model. The older the iPhone, the more sensitive it is to water. I guess that's an interesting comparison, but it is true because we know that when we first got Ophelia, she was sensitive to water, but later doll maker dolls that we got weren't. All right, I have an idea. Let's just start off seeing if she is the creepy doll by putting water on her, because okay. that should be a pretty obvious yeah. one. Oh, we'll grab my spray bottle. In the meantime, see if we can get any information out of her. Who is your master? I don't feel like talking right now. Excuse you. Okay, so I guess I can spray her. Ew! Is that count as we're not liking water? Gross! No. Got me all wet! Guys, this is so hard. Okay, let's just do another test. This says that creepy dolls are known for their teleportation skills. If they're cornered or put oh. in a small space, they're able to get out. I have an idea. There's this box over here following me. Okay, um, just stay here. Oh, gosh. The book said if they're forced into a small space, they'll teleport out of it. Okay, so I guess we can hope that works. Careful. Okay, so let's put... E <gasps> Where'd she go? Did she teleport or did she just move? Eden? Guys, we shouldn't have left her. That was a bad idea. <laughs> Does anyone want to play a game? Uh, yes, yes, yeah. you do. It's called, you have to get in the box first and then... And then we'll look for you. You're gonna go in the box, and then Fine. we're gonna see if a magic trick happens. Okay, go, 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 go in and all the way. If she is the creepy doll. Supposedly, according to the book, she should disappear out of it, but let's see if she's still in there. Uh, hi. Hi. Oh. Okay, so she didn't disappear? This isn't really a fun game. No, because you made it not fun. Get out of the box. Okay, this isn't helpful, guys. We need to get to a point where one of the tests actually works. Let's try this one more of the creepy doll. Okay, what is it? Okay, so according to this, the last thing that they're known for is their powers of telekinesis. So that's basically being able to control things with your mind. Okay, so, are you controlling us with your mind? Not like that. Like, they can make things, like, float. Oh! Like, Hopefully, we're able to figure out what this... What's What's that? Look it. What was that? There's something Wait. over here. Look, look. What is that? What the heck? Did Where'd that come from? That? Did she? Was that something that she did? Did she tell Was she moving something with her mind? Okay, let's see if it maybe floats. Can you make this float? Come on, focus. <gasps> did you just fart? No, sorry, that was me. I knew it. Ew. Okay, okay I say, don't think she's a creepy doll. Yeah, I would say based on the test, I really don't think she's a creepy doll. Obviously, this isn't working. So I'm just gonna put that in there. That leaves three other doll types. So should we try the next one? Yeah. The next doll type is a plush doll. I don't know if you've ever come across a plush doll before. I don't know. Is that what the first doll was, Jack? It says aesthetically, these are the cutest looking, but internally, they're the most mischievous okay that sounds kind of fitting i mean she looks like she could i well i don't know does she look cute she looks more scary it says weaknesses are that they get tired easily okay they're also noisy i mean even has been pretty noisy right she did jump out and yell boo at us right okay maybe let's start doing some of the tests and see if she could be a plush doll okay so it says they fall asleep easily so maybe we should try to get her to take a nap uh oh what? It says strengths, though, are reality distortion. What? So they change what you see in the world. Oh, no. It gets worse. What? what? 
and also they're indestructible. Indestructible? Oh. Okay, there's a picture of one right here. Oh my gosh. I say we try some tests and see if we can figure out whether or not she is the plush doll or not. I agree. Okay, maybe we try putting her to sleep. Here's a pillow. Ew, it's covered in cobwebs. Ew, 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 ew. Okay. Oh, said that the plush dolls go to sleep very easily. Okay. Oh, sleep. Okay, lie down. Pillow. Oh, gosh. You want to sleep, little okay. doll? Because if she falls asleep, then maybe that means that she's a plush doll? Oh, wait, her eyes are closed. Are you tired at are, all? Is she sleeping? Guys, I think she might be a plush doll. Are you tired? Am I a plush doll? No. Wait, guys. She's asleep. I think she's a plush doll. I think she is too. Oh! I don't know. I'm a little tired, but not tired enough for a nap. Ugh. Wait, does that mean though that she is the plush doll? Because it also said they were mischievous, and that was pretty mischievous. Right. Oh, wait. Yeah, I testing. don't know. I feel like she could be a plush doll, but let us know what you guys think down below in the comments, you guys. Well, it said that plush dolls are indestructible. So okay. maybe we could try and gently see if she breaks. Yeah, here, I'll grab a spoon and then we'll like tap her shoulder or something. Oh, she's up there now. Are you a plush doll? What kind of doll are you? Okay, ready? <gasps> you uh -oh. broke me! You crushed that her. Was so mean! I'm sorry, I hardly even touched her! Okay, so uh, okay. she definitely isn't a indestructible doll. No. That wasn't nice! I'm sorry! She is mad at Gabriella. Okay, so she's- I'm very scared. So she's not indestructible, so I kind like she's not a plush doll anymore. Okay, we need to keep doing tests. What's the next doll on the list? We only have two more options left. She's either the classic doll or the porcelain so doll. So 50-50. Yeah. Okay, let's take a look at classic dolls. Okay. Okay, classic dolls. It says these are the typical dolls that you've seen all throughout history. They appear in modern and historical folklore. Okay. Okay. So it says, although they look like regular dolls, there's something more sinister at bay. These are usually possessed with something evil, like a curse or a hex. Ooh. These are like in movies when you think that it's a regular just baby doll, but instead it's- There's like something off about it. Right. Okay. It says, although bad omens tend to circle around them. They're usually not particularly dangerous. Okay, that's good. Okay. It's good to know. No strengths or weaknesses outside of your ordinary bad luck. We need a way to test if we're unlucky or not. So we need to do something that like is heavily luck. Something that can't be rigged and it just is pure luck. Because if she is the classic doll, it said basically the worst that they do is cause bad luck around you. Let's test it out. I think I have an idea. What if we toss something into the glass? Hmm. Oh. But blindfolded because you'd have to be lucky in order to get it in there. Wait, I think this was like a ping pong ball earlier. Uh, ah, here we are. Okay, so I'll cover my eyes and then throw it, and then if it lands in, then I'm lucky, and then if not, I think it's unlucky. All right, here goes nothing. Did it go in? Gabrielle, you did it. That was pretty lucky. Okay, so that seems pretty clear to me that she isn't the classic doll. Maybe we should try one more test. Okay, yeah. One more test. It said that food spoils around them. So let me try having some milk and then see if it is good or bad. Oh boy. I mean, it looks and smells normal. Tastes normal? Tastes normal to me. Okay, so she's clearly not a classic doll then. Okay, so that just leaves one more doll, guys. If you guys remember what it is, comment down below. Last one is the porcelain doll. I'm pretty sure this is what she is based on the rest of the test, but we also need to make sure. Okay, what are the what are the traits? Porcelain dolls are pieces of beauty. They're made from glass. So one of their weaknesses is that they're extremely fragile. She did break when Gabriel smacked her with a spoon. I didn't smack her, I hardly even touched her. Their strength, though, is that they're extremely fast and easily irritable. Okay. I mean, she hasn't done anything that was like extremely fast. Fast. Right, so maybe there can be some sort of test to see if her reflexes are good. Ooh, I love games. Okay. okay. That was really fast. She was literally just sitting on the counter a second ago. So that's definitely our first like official test. Right. How did she even do that? I didn't even blink and I was like, she caught it. The second thing is that she is hollow. So um, do you mind coming over so we can just test something? Whoa. And it also said that she's irritable. I think we have a porcelain doll on her hand. Yeah, she's 
terrifying. It says that she likes to play hide and seek. And she's been asking us all day to play games with her. Oh, it says according to this, porcelain dolls are usually the spirit of dolls trapped inside the porcelain doll shell. The only way that you can get rid of the porcelain doll and find its weakness is by cracking enough that the spirit can escape. So we'll just... Oh no. Wait. Where'd, Where'd she, go? she go? Eden? Eden! Guys. We have to find her. She wants to play hide and seek. She's hiding from us. No! We need to find Eden! Okay, let's go. Eden. Wait, okay, I'm gonna check the kitchen maybe. Eden. What was that? Huh. Okay, guys, I don't know where she is, but I feel like we really need to find her. Any luck? No, we can't find her anywhere. Okay. First of all, what are we gonna even do once we find her? We need a plan of action, because clearly she's tricky. Spoons. I feel like we need to like make her like fall or something like one big break to get the spirit out of her the only problem is that we don't want to hurt actual eden because the doll is just using eden's body essentially to uh, possess her kind of uh wait shh. wait is that her i thought i heard like a tapping noise i think i actually might have an idea what if we can <laughs> Yo, These cobwebs are everywhere. Right away. I'm thinking maybe we could set some sort of trap What's, for her. What that Wait. Wait, I hear her, but I don't I see don't her. I don't see her either. We can't confront her until we have a plan. Right, okay, what were you saying? You said you had a plan. The problem is they're super fast, so I feel like we need to set some sort of trap that oh, will stop her. That's a good idea, so that way we can like catch her, because if we just go after her, she's gonna run away again. So we're gonna have to set a trap that she can't see coming. I think I have an idea, but we're gonna need saran wrap, blankets, and a pillow. Okay, there's blankets upstairs. Okay. Oh, there's so oh. many cobwebs. Oh. Dude, it's just like practically the attic. Oh, it's over here. Wait, where? It was... It was in here, but I can't. Wait, the blanket? Yeah, it won't open now. Somehow it locked. The ribbon on the handle. Did you think that's a hint? On the handle? Wait, was the ribbon on the handle before? Do you remember? I don't think it was. I don't know. Maybe I want to look for another ribbon? What could the ribbon mean? There's another drawer right here. Is that an open? Yeah. yeah. But there's nothing in it. Guys, this is so weird. Do you see anything with the telescope? You can see the mountain all the way over there and a bunch of cactus all the way in the distance. I don't think there's anything out there though. These cobwebs are literally at... Wait. There's a red ribbon. What? There's a red ribbon on the chair. Wait, where? Do you see it? There is. Maybe if I pull this... <gasps> Look. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. We got the blanket. Oh, we got it. Oh. What's up? Wait, is that her? Wait. Wait, why does she have... Where'd she get the pot from? What was that? Okay, okay we need so... the pills and the shrimp wrap. Okay. Wait, is she in there? Yeah. Right. Now we need pillows, but where are we gonna set up the trap? I think we should do it in between the two pillars. Okay, so what exactly is the plan with everything? You'll see, you'll see. Okay, let's go. We have to get pillows. We can go into the bedroom. How many? A all lot. Of them? Yeah. yeah, we should pretty much just grab them all. Oh. Okay. Got Good. Them. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Go, 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 go. So now what? Now we just set up the trap and wait for her to fall into it. One question. Yeah. What's the trap? Okay, let me show you. First things first, we need to put the saran wrap from this pole all the way to that one. Okay, is it gonna reach? I don't know, hopefully. What I'm thinking is that this will stop her since she's so speedy. We'll be on the other side, and then when she tries to come at us, this will slow her down. You can barely even tell it's there. No, you can't, so this definitely is going well, to Well, at least in it. some angles. Like, right here, you can't see it that much. Okay, so we'll just hope that she comes from this angle. Next, we need to put the pillows down because even though we're trying to crack the doll enough that the spirit comes out, we don't want to break Eden. So let's just put these gently here. Next, for the blanket, I'm thinking we put it on the chandelier up there and then when she's underneath we'll let it fall on top of her to trap her i really hope that this works guys give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe wait is that her wait oh 
Oh, oh, we got it, we got her, we got her. Got her. Go. So let's just do one soft, gentle clink and then hope this is enough. All right, ready? No. Did it work? I don't know. Oh. oh. You guys? You didn't back. She Whoa. said it worked. You guys, in the last episode, I actually touched Manny, and since then, it has not been good. I think my we arm... have to amputate it. No, we're not amputating it. My arm literally is like, I guess, turning into a mannequin, but it's really stiff, and like, I can only like, Move it wait, like wait, this. Wait, wait, tap it against the wall. Like, it sounds weird. Yeah. Like, that's not normal. That's not what my arm sounds oh. like when I tap it normally. And I don't even understand because it's obviously spreading, but you guys, I touched Manny too. So, Eden, why does this literally always happen to you? She cursed. I don't know. Only explanation. I'm not cursed. I don't know. Maybe it has to do with because I'm the youngest. Maybe I'm like the most vulnerable, the freshest for all these cores to just latch onto and have things happen to me. Okay, okay, we just need to find Manny and figure out what is going on and maybe Manny can turn you back? If you haven't seen the last episode, go back because you're gonna miss a lot. But basically we have a creepy mannequin that is living in our studio. And is literally growing up. It started as a baby and now he's a toddler and our one rule was to not let it grow up and we are failing. Hey guys. What? Um. Would anyone like to point out where the creepy baby mannequin toddler what? is? Wait. What? Where's Manny? Uh, not again. We can't deal with him moving around the studio. He already played all those pranks on us in the last episode. And now Eden is turning into a mannequin, or at least her arm is. Oh gosh, I didn't Wait. think about that. What if she's actually turning into the mannequin? Oh! Don't say that! We need to find Manny because I don't want to turn into a full mannequin. And I feel like my shoulder and my neck are already Guys, stiff. the phone is ringing. Guys, this is literally a toy phone. How is it ringing? I literally don't understand. Maybe because it has batteries, hopefully? Okay, I guess pick it up. Hello? I want my best <gasps> friend. Wait. I want Waffle. What? I want my friend. Is that Manny? Is that Manny? How is Manny talking to us on the phone? Wait. Guys, what does that mean? Guys, whoa, whoa. whoa. What's whoa, happening? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Guys, what's going on? Oh, Wait, I think Manny's upset. Sorry, I'm on your horse. I didn't mean to. The next dream protector is Manny's nightlight. You must find it. The nightlight? Uh, okay, so if you guys remember, the dream protector is what we need to give Manny before he falls asleep so he doesn't age up. We did not do that last time with the right dinosaur, no. so we have to make sure we get the nightlight so we have the right dream protector so he doesn't grow up anymore. You guys, we need to find Manny now. Good idea. Whoa. Oh. Oh, heck no. Oh, no. Guys, this is not good news. I don't know what to do. We need to find Manny and figure out where he is and how to stop this before my entire body turns into a mannequin. And who knows what happens to me? What? Wait, Manny said he wanted a friend. Do you think that's why Eden's turning into a mannequin? So that way he can have a friend for a Maybe. mannequin? Maybe. The mannequin's making me as a friend. Look, all I'm saying is if you go for a mannequin, we'll do you well. We'll put you in a nice store, the nicest, like Gucci or something. I don't want to be in a Gucci store, I want to be Eden. Let's just think about this. Obviously, Manny is basically a kid, even though he's a mannequin, but he said that he wanted a best friend. So he's turning Eden into his best friend. So maybe if we can just find Manny and convince him not to, he'll be like, okay, I don't I know. Mean, listen. Listen, I'm a fun person even when I'm not a mannequin, okay? Like, I babysit, uh, I love kids, so like, I, I can be his friend. Just not in mannequin form, you know? Wait, what is that noise? Oh God. It's the kitchen. It's coming from the kitchen. Uh, hurry. Wait, there's someone in there. Wait. What? What is this? Are these? Are Royal these, cutie princess? Are these food? <gasps> no. Oh. Uh, what's that? They're dog food. Why would you eat something off the floor? What are you holding stuff a off dog the floor food? all the time? Oh my God. Okay. We don't have. Yeah, we don't have a dog here at least. My Chicken. dogs are at home, Archie and Arlo. So I don't know where this came from because this is all like their food and also this is not their food bowl. So what does this mean? Listen, this is very serious. Everyone needs to listen up carefully. Tonight is the full moon. What do we know about full moons? They're big, they're bright, and werewolves like them. What so are what? werewolves? Dog. What is in our a dog bowl? You think this is from a, a werewolf? werewolf? Yes, I do. Maybe, guys. I don't know. Comment down below why you think that this dog bowl showed up and what this has to do with Manny. <laughs> get us anywhere we need to find manny guys not to be that person but i can literally feel my bones turning solid so if we could just hurry this up a little more and find this dog and figure out what manny wants from us i think these may be droppings 
I no, think it's dog, dog food. food. Wait, but it looks like it's bleeding somewhere. You're right. It's kind of making a path. Like, yeah, before Cole picked it up. Wait, what is going on? Careful, it may be booby trapped. <gasps> Wait, what is that? It's literally a Wait, trap. That's Wait. like one of those traps that you make when you're trying to catch an animal. That and is. there's dog food leading to the dog bone. Somebody's trying to catch a wild dog. Yeah, probably the wild dog that's literally roaming the studio. Whose dog is it though? I think I should investigate. Stay still, everyone. Well, in about probably 10 minutes, I'll probably only be able to stay still because as we're speaking, I can literally feel my bones turning solid. Sounds like you're problem. Let me focus on the matters at hand here. What are you doing? I'm acting like a dog, Are Gabriella. we sure Cole's not the wild dog astray? This looks like the works of a master craftsman. A master trap setter, if I may. The question is, who set up this trap to catch this mysterious dog, and why are they trying to trap it? I will get to the bottom of this. Sherlock Cole. Well, hurry it up, Sherlock Holmes. We don't have that much time. All right, I will get to the bottom of this. Cole, stop messing around. This isn't going to end well. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, guys, what? what? Lift it up. And guys, I literally, I can't lift the box up. It's like it's like glued to the yeah. ground. I can't get it up. Wait, was that part of the trap? There was glue underneath it? You didn't think that the dog was going to be able to get out? How big is this dog? Um, um, maybe we should go find some scissors. Oh, no, 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 uh, not use scissors. Okay, well, I don't know what we're supposed to do. Look, like there's little air holes, so at least you can breathe. Put your fingers Hello? through. Put your fingers through. Do you see it, Cole? Oh, there we go. Cole, we'll get you out of there. We'll get you out. Pinky promise. Okay, what are we gonna do? If the box is glued to the ground, we probably need to get some sort of dissolvent or something. Uh, like, Nail polish remover! Do we have any? I think I have some in my backpack. Okay, let's go. We'll be right back, Cole. Okay. <laughs> Making my way down. <laughs> okay. Uh, guys, it's super hard to walk. Okay, I had my backpack over here somewhere, but it's not hanging up on the coat stand. Where did Someone it go? Someone stole my backpack. I guess let's check the other rooms. Okay. Maybe. Guys, do you think maybe Manny stole the backpack because he wanted to keep Cole trapped in the box? Oh, no. uh oh. What? Look at I found my backpack. What is happening? You guys, do you think this is what? all Manny's doing? It's getting really hard to walk. Oh no, we have to hurry up before eating gets turned into a full mannequin. Um, okay, let's see if we can unclip. Wait, it's like- Yeah, it's like a bungee cord or something. No, it's not a bungee cord, it's a dog leash. A, a dog, dog leash? We need a chair. Wait, so it's another dog thing. Guys, what are all these dog clues meaning? Okay, are you gonna be able to reach it with the chair, Tyler? It's like looped around the top. I don't think I'm gonna be able to reach it. It's the same height as the cow! Wait, but I, I can get a little closer. Wait, oh! Oh! oh. 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 <laughs> saw my light flash before my eyes. That was so scary. I thought your light flash before my eyes. That was terrifying. <laughs> okay, so if we ever find this dog, at least we have a leash now, I guess. Backpack. Okay. No, Perfect. Okay, so let's take this back to Cole. Okay, okay. so okay, let's go find Cole. Okay. okay, we can get him out. Oh, okay. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Okay, Cole, don't worry, we got it. Cole? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We need to get him out of here. Okay. Maybe, maybe he has lack of oxygen in there. But there was a little hole, so we should have been able to breathe. Okay, hold on. Okay, wait. It's getting loose. Ah. <gasps> Cole? Where is he? Wait. He couldn't have escaped because it was still glued. How and where is he now? I'm starting to feel the left side of my body get like stiff. Okay, Guys, okay. I have okay. a feeling Manny is behind all of this. We need to find him. Oh gosh, okay. This is really bad. We don't have any leads at this point. It doesn't feel like there's any more clues. It's just been all the things that have happened to Cole so far at this point. Wait a second. Who pulled the trap in the first place? What do you mean? When the trap fell, it only fell because someone pulled that rope and pulled the stick out from under the box. <gasps> Wait, you're right. Wait, it was it was that one that was there because we were all standing behind it, but when Cole went underneath it, someone pulled the string. Okay, guys, before we go inside, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to become a part of our one big family because we are posting videos all this summer and you don't want to miss them because we need your guys' help to solve these mysteries. Okay, uh, ready? Yeah. Three, Three two, two, one. 
<gasps> what the heck? Mom. Oh no. What is this? Lost, Lost dog. dog. They're everywhere. If found, please return. They're wait, all wait. over. It says color white breed mannequin. It's not a real dog. It's Manny's dog. Description, a friendly likes Waffles responds to his dog whistle. That's what Manny was saying on the phone. His best friend, Waffles. Guys. What? Oh, what? what? <gasps> oh, no. no. Missing brother. How's our brother? Our brother's missing. Color none, breed human. Description, talks very fast, has nice teeth, eats lots of tacos, can get angry when he's hungry, he and angry. goes by the name of Cole. Reward $10,000 a found? But the question is, where is Cole? That doesn't help us actually find out where he is. All we know is now he's officially lost. Wait, maybe Cole's where the dog is, so if we can figure out where the dog is, we can figure out where Cole is. Okay, that makes sense. Guys, I don't even understand. What does this all mean? Let me see this. I don't think it means anything. I think it's just one endless puzzle, and if we don't find this dumb dog, Wait, we're guys, gonna be stuck like this. What? Ah! Oh! Steven! Oh, no, no, no. She, she fully turned into a mannequin! Oh, no. Guys, this is so bad. She's completely gone. Eden! Oh, uh, oh, uh, okay. Eden! What do we do? What do we do? I don't know. Cole is missing. Eden's now a mannequin. Guys! Okay, she said she figured something out. So we have to look at this and figure out what she figured out so we can get her out. Okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Eden. Okay, she said she figured something out. Okay, talks very fast. Wait, guys. Okay, if you look at this, it's each of the letters are bold so maybe she found like a clue in that is that what you're trying to tell us Eden? the letters that are bold are t h e c a r the car the car the car oh guys i feel like it's right there if you know the answer leave it down below in the comments Wait, tell me on the thing what are you, i don't get what you're saying okay so it's t h e c a r the car does that mean cole's in the car Wait, okay. car. Dogs aren't supposed to be in the car and neither are people because it's hot in the car. Okay, hang in here, Ian, and we'll be right back. Oh gosh. <sighs> okay, it says the car. Wait, is that Cole? Wait, why is he in the car? What is he doing? Is he stuck? I think he's stuck in the car. Wait, okay, hold on. Let's go outside. Oh. Are you stuck? Okay, wait. Stay here. We'll go get the keys to meet in. Okay, we have to go. Guys, Cole cannot be in the car any longer. It's so hot in there. Okay, let's go find Eden. Let's get the keys. We need to get the keys from Eden. Okay, Eden's the one who probably had the keys last. Oh my gosh, she moved. Wait, she's in a different position. Okay, do you think she's like trying to like break out and reach us? Maybe like she's trapped inside the mannequin. Right, okay. Eden, don't worry. If you can hear us, we got you. We just have to get Cole out of the car and we'll be right back. Okay, let's go. We need to hurry. Okay, we need to get him out. We need oh to get him out. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Uh, oh, no, no, no. He doesn't look good. He doesn't look good. Oh, oh, guys, I think it might have gotten too hot. Okay, he's okay, he's okay. What? Water. Okay, Cole, don't worry, we'll get you some water. Here, come on, come on, let's get him out of the heat. Okay, oh gosh, oh gosh. The car was almost 103 degrees on the dashboard. Oh my gosh, why would we need do this? Okay, just, just, just sit here. What? Sit here. Okay. Oh, okay. Cole, okay, we need you to tell us what you remember. Okay, get, oh, get him some water. Okay, water, water. okay, okay, Cole, once we get him some water, you'll be okay. And then we need you to remember everything and tell us what happened. Oh. Guys, this is so bad. Eden is a full mannequin. Cole needs water from the heat, and I just don't even know what's happening. Do you have the water? Okay. Oh, okay, take a sip, take a sip, okay. Oh, wow. He's oh, thirsty. wow, really thirsty. Oh, I got the collar. What color? What? Is that the dog's collar? Wait, let me see. <sighs> Waffles! The poster said that the dog's name was Waffles. Guys, so we have to find the dog. So this just proves everything. Its name is Waffles. That is what Manny was trying to tell us on the phone earlier. He missed his best friends. He wanted Waffle. This is Manny's dog, Waffles. Okay, cool. We need to hurry because Eden turned into a mannequin. She turned into a, uh, she turned in all the way to the mannequin? Yeah, like fully mannequin. What did this happen? How did you let this happen? You were the one who was in the car. No. Okay. Eden, oh, no, no, no. She moved again. Oh Wait. my god. Guys, I don't know what's happening. Maybe it's like trying to find her final form before she's stuck in it for forever. Okay, let's bring her to the front. Yeah. How are we supposed to do 
Why? You just lift. Maybe Cole and I can talk. Okay, so maybe like go ahead and like lift her up. Oh, oh, careful, careful, careful. Oh. Like, got it. Okay, good. Good, good. Careful, careful, you guys. guys she this may is be so communicated, but she's still eating. All right. Okay, we've never had to deal with something like this before. She's so literally an actual mannequin. Step is a board. That is a feather. Watch her elbow. Careful. Oh, what's on her plate? Stop. Careful, there's no time. Save the okay. turtles. Okay. You got this. Okay, in in, no, wait, in the no, room. You go forward. Rotate. Careful. Back it careful, up. Careful, careful, careful. Back it up. Beep. Okay. Beep. All right, just because she's a mannequin, we don't know if that means she can feel or not. So we have to be so careful. Get her up. All the way. Oh. We're right. good? So. Okay. Oh, that was close. Guys, that was so difficult. Wait. What's that smell? Sorry. Like, no. It, de oh. it definitely smells like waffles, oh. but like they're burning. They smell nasty. Wait. It's the toy oven making waffles? Uh oh. Fire. Fire hazard. Oh, God. Fire oh, hazard. God. Careful. Fire hazard. Okay. Oh. Wait. Guys. I think I understand what's happening. Waffles. Nanny thinks if he makes waffles, it will attract waffles his dog. Man, this is best friend. I figured it out, guys. Manny. It's Manny's dog. Manny's best friend, man's best friend. Dogs are man's best friend. This whole thing has been about Manny wanting his dog. He doesn't want to turn Eden into the mannequin. I think he just wanted to get our attention. He knew that we needed something big to help him find his dog. So we, if we find the dog, then maybe Eden will turn back. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, let's go back. Eden, we figured it out. We have to find a waffle in order for you to turn back into a regular person. Wait, what's she doing? She wants us to pull her finger. It's the classic fart trick. No, what? She is pointing at Manny. He's holding a dog whistle. Since he's a mannequin, he can't blow the whistle to find waffles. Oh. Okay, ready? Hopefully this works. Oh, all aboard. What? <gasps> it's waffles! Wait, that's actually him. Oh, good boy. Eden! Eden, you're back! Oh wait. my gosh! Wait, I'm back! I'm fully articulated! Guys, oh my this god! This dog is so cute! What did Manny get a dog? Who took him to the pet store? Can we keep him? Hmm, I don't know. After he caused all the problems that we had today, you want to keep Manny's creepy little dog? I mean, if Manny really likes him that much, and maybe it'll also tame Manny, because listen, the dog didn't turn me into a mannequin. Manny turned me into a mannequin. Wait, what's on the dog? A note? No, but it's empty. Oh gosh, just another thing we need to figure out. But guys, if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. I don't get what this is. It's literally just blank. Wait, I have an idea. Shut the door, shut the door. Okay, so I realized this wasn't just a blank piece of paper. It's an undeveloped photo. Oh. So I have to put it in the solution so that way we can develop it and see what it is. I think this is another Manny craziness where it's supposed to be like this clue that we're supposed to figure out. Oh, okay, that makes sense. So wait, something will okay. appear on there? Right, so it says let that sit for a second and then let it appear. Wait. It looks like something's showing up. I see it. <gasps> Wait, something's starting to Wait, fade in. Wait, it's starting to develop. Okay, look. Whoa. Invitation. You were invited to Manny's birthday party to what? celebrate his last day as a toddler before officially becoming a kid at the end of the day. Where? The Scory Studio? Guys, how is Manny throwing a birthday party? He didn't tell us he was throwing a party. Well, this is his way of telling us. Wait, guys. A last day of being a kid? That means he's gonna grow up again! Wait, oh. we can't let that we happen. We cannot let that happen. Don't let we it already grow. let him grow up, okay? We need to keep him young. Let's go find him and find the dream protector so he can't grow up! Okay. okay, wait, let's go into his room and see if he's in there. Manny? Manny? Manny! Wait, he's not in his crib. Oh, uh, okay, what do we do? <gasps> what was that? <gasps> see? What are you doing here? Well, don't act so surprised. I got the same invite you guys did. You're not having a party without me. Oh, oh no. God. So oh, it looks like we're all going to the party. Wait, Gabriella, what's happening? What's happening? What are you shaking? This is good. Gabriella? Oh. Gabriella, what's wrong? What? Oh. 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 oh, my precious. <laughs> Guys, in case you missed last episode, the witch doll turned into Gabriella. So now Gabriella's a witch. You say that like it's a <laughs> okay, I need earplugs being around her. She's loud. Yeah, literally every 10 seconds she just does that ah, 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 screech. It's literally so annoying. Don't make me put a spell on you. 
Gabrielle. <laughs> There it is again. Okay, so we need to figure out how to turn Gabriella back into Gabriella and not the witch. Yeah, because right now the witch doll is taking over Gabriella, and if we know anything about these dolls, is that they, they do not like to give up the body that they're holding. We have to figure out a way to get our sister back. If only Ophelia was still here. Ah! Don't mention that wretched doll. You gotta give me a warning when you scream like that. That nearly gave me a heart attack. Okay, what does the witch have against Ophelia? Don't say her name. Okay, oh my god. I don't know what the witch has against Oh, but if I know one thing, it's that she should be here right now, okay? I can feel her. She's definitely near, but it seems like there's something blocking her from actually getting here. She's gonna hit me with her broom. Oh. I don't like you. You're too tall. <laughs> For once being short comes into play. No, I know. We need to figure out how to get Gabriella back, okay? So let's figure out what this stupid witch wants. Hey! That's me. Wait, where's she going? Oh. Wait, there she is. What you think is within the door? <gasps> wait, maybe okay. O is in there. Wait, guys, that must be not O is in the room. Okay, wait, why do we, um, uh, we, would, we, like, we, like, we would like to get in the room. All you have to do is spin a six or higher and then let you in. Easy. Not so fast. In order to get a spin, you each must bring me some candy! <laughs> candy? Wait, okay, so we just need to go find some candy. There must be candy hidden somewhere in the studio. Hurry! <gasps> Wait, candy, candy, what are these? Those are trick or treating fails. Wait, and then what do you put in trick or treating buckets? Candy. candy. There's one in front of each of the doors. I'll take this one. Okay. okay. I guess I'll take this one. Okay. And then you go down to the diner. This must be how we're going to get the candy, you guys. And I have to say, I don't really like Gabriella's a witch, so we definitely need to get her back to Gabriella. We have no idea how long the challenges are going to be in each of the rooms. So if you get the candy, try and get inside so we can find... Oh, okay. Let's do this. We'll meet you guys back at the door. No, okay. just go inside if you get the candy. Don't oh. wait for us. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Did you not listen to anything you just said? Okay, going in. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Guys, I guess I'm in the foggy room, so if I were to guess, I think each room probably has a challenge to be able to find the candy. I can hardly see my hand in front of me. Okay, I'm just gonna start looking for some candy. Oh wait, I found this right here. Okay, got a piece. Hopefully she likes chocolate and peanut butter. Uh, oh my gosh, it's literally so foggy, you guys. Okay, uh, I'm going under. Uh, let's see. Ow! Oh my gosh, I just hit my head, it's so hard. Ow, it's because I can't see anything. Ow, I'm going to go. Okay, um, oh. Maybe it's this? There's literally nothing else in the room. After the whole nanny situation. Um, the room is completely empty now. So where's the start to this? I have no idea. Oh, here it is. Okay, so do I, I, I guess I'm just gonna unwrap. Here we go. On that. Oh, but a piece of candy, that was easy. Let me just put in my trick or treat bucket here. Trick or treat, witch. I've got candy for you. Okay, this is my room. Why'd the lights just turn off? Hello? Um, it's pitch black in here. I literally can't see anything. I can't even see my hand in front of my face. Okay, so I guess that's, this is the challenge. It's trying to figure out where the candy is in here um okay so i'm just gonna feel around and then try to see if i can find the candy anywhere in here uh wait <gasps> wait here's one here's one okay i got one in the kit oh no ah i just dropped it i just dropped it um uh, i dropped it around here somewhere um where did it go it literally it fell down here <laughs> Oh my god! What? What's wrong with you? That scared me so bad. Ow, my head hurts. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, I found another piece right here. Um, maybe under the, oh, under the pumpkin there was some. Okay, oh, right here. Okay, let me look under the couch over here. Wait, is she still in here? Um, excuse me? This is which? There you go. I see you found me a piece of candy. Uh -huh. You must spin a six or higher. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So how's it, how's it going, lady? 
that was a long spin. Oh gosh. Are you kidding me? Bye! Not tie it up! <laughs> yeah, I guess I have to try to go find more candy. She's kind of mean. I don't like her. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I feel like that's enough. Enough to see if she'll let me in. <laughs> that's so scary. Okay, I'm gonna go ask the, the witch if this is enough candy to let me into the room. Hey, girl! I brought you some candy. Oh, 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 oh. One spin per piece of candy. You must get that sex eye. I'm gonna miss that path. Well, all right, six or higher. Let's go. Okay, spin, 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 spin. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up because we are gonna defeat this witch and get Gabrielle back. Oh, what is happening? No, oh, what a shame. I more candy. What? Did she just use her witch power magic to make it go to one? Oh my gosh. Okay, ready? Spin, 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 spin. What are you gonna land on? Spinning, spinning, down I mean, it goes. I'm would it be a shame? <gasps> no one knows. What the heck, guys? This is rigged. I am not gonna go back into that bog room and have to get more candy. Come on, six or higher, six or higher. I can do it. Just summon it. Use my strength over the witch's strength. Are you talking to an inanimate object? Yes, eight. Can I go in? Fine. Okay, I'm going in. Whoa. Where is the candy? How much is in here? This is nuts! Here's another one. Oh shit. Uh, let's go for one more. Oh, are you kidding? Are you kidding me? More aluminum foil! Oh! I don't even know where that came from. But I will take it. Okay, I think three should be enough. So let's go. Let's go give her some more candy. She really scares me though. I'm kind of scared. So we're just gonna hope for the best. Witch lady. Do you have like candy? Oh, oh, oh. You, little boy, are testing me. And I don't like to be tested. Six star higher. I'm gonna break the door. Seven! You may enter. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, whoa. Guys, this is so cool. Did it! Oh, oh, I did it. Okay, okay. Wait, how did, how did she get? I don't know. Uh, excuse me. Yeah! I, I uh, have two pieces of candy for you. So, one spin. Get above a six and you can go in. Okay, guys, we need to get in there so that we can hopefully find you know who. Okay, spin, six or higher, six or higher, six or higher. Come on, come on, come on. Huh, I don't wanna look. This is for waking me up from my nap. What? She spun my spin, that's not fair. Okay, come on. Uh, it's taking a long time, this long spin. Okay, three, three. So sad. Okay. I only have one more chance, so hopefully this one I can get it on. Okay, this one I'm spinning by myself. Okay, ready? I'm gonna do it really, really hard. Okay, and... Spin the wheel to get inside. What you need is going to hide. <laughs> what that means. <laughs> you got lucky. Okay, and that means I can go into the room. Oh my oh. gosh, they could have do it. I made it all in here. Yeah, I've been trapped forever. What are we supposed to do now that we're in this room? I don't know, it's like seven oh. you. That's what you're supposed to do. Huh? Uh, again, really? How With the surprise entrances? It's getting a little old, Whitney. I've enchanted the door, so you'll never be able to escape. 
Guys, this isn't good. Wait, is the door actually not opening? No, it's not actually opening. Oh no. Okay, well, we can't stay trapped in here forever, so there's yes, obviously. Yes, you can. No, we can. Yes, you can. No, we can. Yes, you can. Guys, this isn't good. We have to figure out a way to get through the witch and get back to Gabriella because we need Gabriella back here. She can't stay as the witch forever. No. Especially because we need to find O and we need to find her fast. And I feel like we need all four of us to be able to do that. There is one way. What? 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 One way. Well, I love a good challenge. So, if you can give me six. I'll let you leave. Six spiders? How do we get six spiders? All you have to do is play my games and then you can leave. Wait, the room. It's set up with a bunch of different games all throughout it. If we win the games, we must get a spider. So we have to get six spiders and then we'll be able to leave and figure out how to get Gabriella back. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay, there's six games in here, so we need to partner up and go head to head so one of us can win those spiders. Cool! You're up first! Pick someone to go head to head with! I'll pick Eden because I don't think she's as athletically inclined as I am, shall we say? Okay, we're not running a marathon, we're playing Halloween games. Give me the ring. Whoever gets the most rings on the end gets the first spider! Easy! <laughs> All right, well, that's a lot of talk, but let's see if you can walk. All right, you go first, small. All right. Hey! Interference! Hey! hey. Oh, oh, I didn't get one. Oh, come on, shoot. Oh, so close. I don't want to talk about that one. Guys, that wasn't good. Okay, we need to win these challenges to get those spiders. Cole, put a little more hand coordination into your throat. Huh? Oh, so close. Oh! Oh, my gosh. Oh! Here we go! Oh! Yes! Oh! I won! I got the spider! I won the first spider, you guys! I like how you think that's impressive! Huh? This gonna... is a game for baby goblins! Wait, well, it was like a little impressive, like I got a spider. Okay, maybe my spider- Oh! It's right here! Okay, so I got the first spider. Here you go, Madam Moselle. Okay, next game! Winner gets their pick! Um, I get to pick the next contestant to go head to head with, so I guess I'll do Tyler because okay. he hasn't done a challenge yet. All right, remember, one of us just has to win and get the spider so that we can get out of here. Right, but I also kind of want to be the one who actually wins the spider because who knows if there's something bad for people that don't have enough spiders. Just saying. Wait, you're right. Okay. Oh, two for points. For you. Oh, oh, no, I didn't get a point. Okay, I'm going to try to go for three. Say hi, Gretchen. You only get the sacks you have. <gasps> Okay, so it's just these two. Okay, so I'm at two points right now and you're at zero. Okay, I have to get the three. Okay. Oh no, I got the one. Okay, I'm just gonna go for two again. Oh, oh no! Okay. I only have two points! As long as I get one point or higher, then it will at least tie. Uh, tie. Uh, oh! Wah, wah, no. wah. I <laughs> Okay, like Tyler said, we don't know what's gonna happen if something bad's gonna happen to the so at this point, I just want to make sure that I keep winning the games to stay ahead. Wow! I can promise that something bad will happen to one of you. What does she mean by that? What does she mean by that? Okay, I don't want to find out. <gasps> Second spider. Okay. Oh gosh, I'm getting tangled in the web. Here you go. Second spider. Such a cute look. Okay, um, I guess I'll just pick Cole and then alternate. Wow, wow, wow. If it isn't the rivalry of the century. I assume you know how to play trick tac toe. I mean, I know how to play tic tac toe. Okay, um, I guess I'll be. I want to be X's, you be O's. All right, I'll go first. You go first. Yeah, I won. Okay, ready? <sighs> you play it. It's not that difficult. Okay, guys, I have to be so strategic about where I place this. Okay. I want to make sure that I can get ahead of Cole and that. Okay, you're messing me up. I'm trying to strategize here. I win. We have one person who's given me three spiders. Yes. 
nothing from you two. We're trying. Your Try harder. The breath smell. I am going to lay a little curse on you. Cool. Oh, don't test the witch, okay? We don't need any more problems than the ones that we already have. Just hold it together. Let's get these spiders. I have an idea. Find out and get careful about. I have an idea. What? Remember the the ring game we were playing? Why don't we use your big nose and throw the rings on your nose? Hurry! I have the next spider. So three spiders in. Tyler, you're up next. Throw the spiders to get the pine. Ew! You guys, they're like these gooey, sticky spiders. Hurry, right, Tyler, you're up next. Okay. Uh, I feel like you're gonna do pretty good at this. Uh, I'm hoping so. Okay, let's see it. Come on, get it on the spider web. Oh. oh. No. They didn't even make the bar. Okay, I'm gonna try to grab it by the leg, maybe, and then yeah, good kind idea. Of like throwing it like <gasps> oh oh wait wait three, three points yeah. three three points that's really good, Tyler. Okay, okay. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do any better at this one. <gasps> oh, oh. One, four no. points. Okay, that's not bad, Eden. Okay, first one. <laughs> oh, I got it way up oh, the web. Oh, it's way up there. Wrong web. Let me try. Let me try your strategy. Grabbing it kind of low on the leg. Oh, uh, one. oh, one, one point. Okay, then. Uh, oh no! It Where got intercepted by this web right here. We only got one point, you guys. We have our winner. I can't believe my winning streak just broke, you guys. Oh, okay. I guess Tyler's the winner. I guess that means that I win the spider this time. So. There you go. There's only two left, guys. Then we'll be able to escape this room and then we'll finally be able to find up. I'm gonna challenge Cole to the second to last game, which is the pumpkin toss. We each have three balls and we have to total up the score and see who has the highest score. All right. Okay, yeah, because each of these have numbers written on them. I wanna see which one has the most points. All righty, let's see what you do. And then when we're done, I'll let you all be. Going for that. Oh, oh, so close. Okay, so actually, close. I'm gonna go for those three right there because there's a better chance of getting one. Oh, nice. Five. Okay, and let's go one more time. Oh, okay, five points. Hopefully that's enough, but I'm not sure it will be. All right, okay. Joel, you're up next. Yikes. Oh. Oh. Six. Oh. oh. No. <laughs> Zero points for you. Listen up, witch lady. Say. Yeah. Cool. You got something on under the tip of your nose. After this, we'll only have one more spider left until we can leave the room. Right. And here Boop. you go. One final game and one final spider. Okay. Eden, I'm gonna challenge you, so okay. let's have you and I do the last one. Sounds good. I definitely feel like this is the hardest challenge because the spider's literally moving in the air. Okay. And it's like so hard to see because it's so dark in here. Alright. First one. Oh, now it's like spinning. Oh no, oh. I completely missed. Oh, oh I got one. Okay, I got one. So okay. that's 30 points. 30 points. All right, guys, I'm feeling good. Oh, oh it was on it, but it fell. All right, ready? And this is an Don't miss. Oh, gosh, I'm excited to get 30 or higher on this one. No. I did it. I won again. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. All right, which this is the last spider. We officially gave you all six of the spiders. Now, what do I get? What's my prize? The prize of all prizes. Wait, what is it? It's not what it is. It's what's within that will give you the answer. What's up with her and her metaphor? There's one more final challenge that you'll each compete in to get the golden prize. <gasps> Follow me. Oh, oh, so the door yeah, opens the door when she does. Wow. Wow. Whatever is in that skull, we have to get it. Yeah, that might be our answer to turning Gabriella back into Gabriella. What is what is this? What, what are we what are we doing? It's simple. The one who knocks down the most pins will be the winner of the golden prize. Sweet! Where's the bowling ball? Here it is. Um This is a pumpkin. And I'll go first. Okay, I guess I've never really gone bowling with a pumpkin before, so let's see how this goes. Ready? Butterball. Oh, not good enough. Okay, but in bowling, you get two tries, so I get one more turn. Okay, come on. Good luck, pumpkin. Come on, you can do this again. Okay, great, that's pretty good. I got, oh. 
Okay. Okay. You got almost all, all though, except one. Okay, so either someone has to beat me or I win. Good luck, Tyler. All right. Let's see. Let's see what your bowling skills endeavor. Three, two, one. <laughs> I got okay. one too. Okay. So, so either knock it down or tie. Right. Maybe. Okay. I I just have to get one. I think I can do this. Okay. Come on, Tyler. You got it. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. <sighs> it was so close. The other pin almost hit it and knocked it over. Okay. Cole, I guess you're up next. Okay, the only possible way that Cole is gonna win this is if he gets a strike. Otherwise, Eden and I will be tied. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I mean, I, I guess did. that counts as a strike. Give it to us, bitch. All right. I am bitch in my wed. Here you go. Alright, open it up and see what's inside. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure you press the subscribe button. We're about to see what's inside. Probably like golden skull. Real gold or diamond or an apple. Wait, an apple. how are we supposed to use an apple to get Gabriella back? I mean, I guess. Go thanks, I'm pretty hungry. Wait, Wait no, 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 don't eat it. Oh. No, no, it's not is. It's not good. That's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. Where did she go? Wait, hold on. Do you feel okay? Wait, what's happening? No, no! Paul, Paul, Paul! Where'd she go? Where'd she go? You Eden? Eden? Is that you? Eden is not here anymore. Ah! What do you mean? Our sister turned into evil Ophelia. Hey, scoring family. We have to figure out how to turn Eden back into Eden because Gar and like. When we went into the dollhouse, we accidentally broke the number one rule and we accidentally unleashed the spirit of Anubis and we think that that got inside of the creepy Ophelia doll and now it transformed into Eden. Very smart. You catch a long fast. <gasps> Wait, guys, do you see what's around Eden's neck? What? It's the same necklace that the evil Ophelia doll was wearing. Do you think that that's how she's controlling Eden? In the last episode, when Eden passed out, she was wearing that necklace and she wasn't wearing that the rest of the episode. Um, easy. <laughs> I'll just take it all. <laughs> Give me the next one. Are you okay? Ow! I just got body slammed by Ophelia. Don't touch me. Okay, clearly we're gonna have to think of a different way to get the necklace oh, off of Eden. I think I broke my femur. Oh, okay, think, 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 think. Guys, how are we supposed to get this off of her? The old Ophelia used to like games. Do you want to play a game? Interesting. I do love a good challenge. Okay, so how about we challenge you to some games, and if we win, we get the necklace. Yeah. But be warned, my challenges this time will not be easy. And if you lose them, you'll never see your sister again, because I'll take on this form of Eden forever. Oh my gosh, okay, you guys. That's bad. The stakes could not be higher. We have to win these challenges so we can get our sister back. For the first challenge, I'm feeling a little bit hungry. Well, we can fix that. Oh, you will. In the bucket are all of my favorite snacks. Collect 10 of them and you'll win this challenge. If not, you'll have to find out. Okay, uh, that seems easy enough, right? Maybe maybe her favorite snacks, Eden's favorite snacks, uh, the jackfruit. <laughs> okay, we can do this, you guys. We just have to work together as a team to get her favorite snack, whatever that is. Well, look what we have to dig through. You, you might think sick. you'll be able to find my favorite snacks, but it's not that easy. Each bucket is filled with a challenge, so let's see if you can get past it. Go! Ah, oh Oh, oh, Ew! Oh. It looks like garbage! What is it? Goodbye, oh, baby dookie. Oh, wait, is this one of the snacks? Well, yeah, what is it? Guys, I think eyeballs are evil Ophelia's favorite snack. Ew! Oh. Okay, we have to keep looking. Okay, someone else start on the ice one. I'll okay, work Cole, you go first. I'm scared of cold water. Wait, Cole, one. it's oh. cold water or not getting your sister back. Ah! That's freezing! Ah, what? Grab the eyeball! Don't tell me this isn't cold. Oh, 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 oh. Grab the eyeballs and I throw them. No, Ew. stop throwing them. Ow. Ow. Where's Wait. the last one? I can't find the last one. Ow, my fingers are so bad. Ow. 
Ow. Yo, go my hand is. Oh, oh, that is cold. Okay, just read the narrative. Ow. Ow, there it is, there it is. Okay, good, good, good. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have six eyeballs. Time's ticking. <laughs> I'm getting hungry. I think she said 10, right? Okay, let me try looking in here. Oh my gosh. That looks satisfying. This, I mean, honestly, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of satisfying, but it's really hard to feel because there's all these like marshmallows in here, so I can't feel any eyeballs. Every time I think I have something, it's just more marshmallows. This one might be the hardest one. I don't think there's any more in this one, so I'm gonna go into the slime one. I literally can't find any eyeballs. It's so hard. Look in here. Okay, there has to be some. Wait, here's another one. Oh, Ew, the slime one. No, she's so close to oh, you. Oh, oh. Wait, no. Oh, guys. They're You're not very good at this game. I know. This slime looks disgusting. It's too foamy. It's impossible to feel anything. Wait, here's another one. Oh, you found one? There I, is I think so, yeah. There, oh, okay. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Ah, time's, time's ticking. ticking. You oh, only oh, have oh, one oh, minute. One minute! What if we take some of it and put it in here? So oh, so that was. Spread it out and see. So we can look for some? Okay. Okay, guys, we need to hurry, we need to hurry, we need to hurry. Where are these eyeballs? Yeah, well, I thought this one would be so easy, but it's like too light. It's too much. Wait, we only need two more, right? Uh, Cole, how many more do we need? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, ah! Where is an eyeball? Guys, I found one. Oh, I found one. Okay. Try to wait this one up. Ten. Try to this one off. Ah! Nice! Three, three. Yeah. Is that eight? Wait, one, two, that's two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten! Nine, ten, ten. We got it. Well, Whoa. well, well. Congratulations. Thank you. But next time, I don't think you'll be as lucky. What does that mean? What's the next challenge? Are you threatening us? For oh my, my next God. challenge, you'll be competing directly against me. <gasps> Oh gosh. I don't like the sound of that. Okay, let's go. For the next game, we have a life-size version of tic-tac-toe. But this isn't just any tic-tac-toe. It's strategy tic-tac-toe. The way that this tic-tac-toe works is you have five blocks, and they can be stackable as long as you have one size bigger than the previous block. It'll be you against me, and I don't. Play easy. So basically, it's tic tac toe, but the other player can steal your space if they have a bigger block than you. What? This is gonna be actually tricky because I know strategy to tic tac toe, but I've never played this version before, and it seems very complicated. Feeling it, evil feel like kind of strikes me as the one kind of thing to cheat. I mean, I don't know. Do you start with your biggest box or your smallest box? Like, how does this work? Which story is playing first? Darrell is. Why am I going first? Good luck. As the game host, I'll be going first. Okay. Oh, thank you. Here, I'll just take this. Okay, so she started with like a medium sized one and put it in the middle. Okay. okay. Are you gonna steal it by using a bigger one or use one of your smaller ones? I think maybe I'll wait to steal a space and then just put my medium sized box here. Okay. Oh! Oh! <gasps> oh! Oh no. She, she just took the space! Wait, she only has one more spot until she wins. Okay, so I'll put my big box. Oh, smart, smart, so she can't eat it. Here, what are you gonna do now, evil Ophelia? Uh oh. Oh. Okay, um, guys. Uh, problem? Oh no. Big problem. Did she trick me? Guys, this seems like a lose-lose situation. I don't know where to go. Um, I guess let me eat this one. Or, can I eat this one? That's the same size. Okay, if I can't eat this one, then I'm gonna eat the middle one. Okay, good. Stop her from getting three in a row here. Okay. Gabriella, Gabriella, Gabriella. What? I would have thought that this would have been a little more of a challenge. No, no, no. Oh, I two, didn't even see two, that. Three. This is so much harder to play on a big level because Cole was standing there, so I didn't even think of it as a spot. No, do not blame this on me. Cole, we are literally all one team. I love winning. Who shall I beat next? You or me, who wants to go? I'll go. Hey, I'll feel ya. Word on the street is you're a jump at checkers. This isn't checkers. What is this? Chet! Ch oh! Yes! <laughs> it's tic tac toe. Oh! Word on the street, Ophelia, is that you're a jump at tic tac toe. I think you need to learn your games before you challenge me. She used the tiny one. We didn't use the tiny one last round. Okay, well, I'll use my tiny one. Boom! 
Okay, one there, one there. What's she gonna do? She's thinking. Guys, I feel like she's upping up her game. One there. Be careful, Cole. You can't let her win. Oh no. How do I defeat her beat? With this. Cole ate one of the pieces. Very interesting. Very indeed. You are a cheater. How is she a cheater? Well, that's literally how you play the game. Rude. Okay, you know what? Okay, so she has one right there. Okay. And one right there. This one. Right there. Uh oh. Oh no, Doing Cole. Oh, Cole. No, 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 Cole. 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 Oh, that's Cole. three in a row. One, no, two, three. Four, four. Looks like Cole. you're on your way to losing your sister, Cole. Eden, forever. Okay, Tyler, can't do this. you have to win this round. One more chance. If Tyler can't beat me, then it's game over for you guys. This is so stressful, guys. Okay, I think I have a strategy now after watching the first two, so it does give me an advantage that I'm going last. All right, Tyler versus Eden slash Evil Ophelia. All right, since I'm feeling bad about your miserable losses, I'll let Tyler go first this time. Okay, that's good, that's good. Okay. Wait, think about this very, very carefully, Tyler. I'm gonna do something a little bit different, and I'm starting with my biggest one. Because okay. she can't undo this one no matter what. It's always good to have control of the corner, so I'm gonna start there. Oh, Your wow. turn. I guess being Tic-Tac-Toe Club president did Tyler some good. All right, well since Tyler is his biggest one, he'll never be able to eat this one. So I'll use mine next. Oh, she had the point. That was oh, good. No. That was good. Okay. Now we're gonna switch things up and use the small one because that'll give me flexibility in case she eats it. So I'm going to go here. And I'm going to go here. Tyler, you have to think about this so carefully. Which means I have to use this one to stop her. So I'm not big enough to eat that one. I'm big enough to eat that one, but I can't put it in the middle because then she would use her big one to eat that one, which means I have to put it right here. Okay, this is giving so intense, guys. This is the most intense game of tic-tac-toe that I have ever played in my entire life. If you guys haven't subscribed already, make sure to do that because we're going to need all the help that we can get as we try and defeat evil Ophelia. Well, since you ate mine, it only seems fitting that once again on this square, another one gets eaten. Oh, no! Oh, brother. Give me a break, Ophelia. Okay, that means I have to use this one to stop her from getting three in a row by putting it right here, which is good because that's that one's the same size, so she can't eat that one. Okay, I feel like we're getting one step closer. I only have one left. No, it's gonna be a tie. <gasps> because she has two here, which means I have to stop her, otherwise she'll use her last one right here. But then I don't have enough to make a three in a row. All right, that means I'm gonna have to put it right here. And then she's got to put hers. Hmm. Very interesting. Oh, the undefeated was defeated. Okay. It was a tie. What does that mean? Tie means that we move on to the tiebreaker. Tiebreaker. What does that mean? What is that challenge going to be? You'll have to find out. I hope you're all in the mood for a puzzle. But this isn't just any puzzle. This is a 3D life-size puzzle. You guys will be timed, and you have to get the right picture on each side of the puzzle. Your time starts five seconds ago. What? How are we supposed to figure out what the thing is? right here. Wait, wait, start by looking at the corners, because this corner is half yellow, half pink. So start putting all the yellow and pink ones together. Okay. Um, this is yellow and pink. Is this yellow and pink? Is this yellow and red? Red. Oh, it's also so dark in here. Okay, this I one. I got purple and yellow. Purple. Maybe we should start on one side. Maybe we should just do one side. Maybe? Time's ticking. Okay, okay, okay. So, okay, so, let's just find all the yellow pieces. You've been off of stuff on one box for a long amount of time. You know what, Ophelia? I'm not appreciating you. Okay, here's yellow. yellow. Wait, this looks like maybe like the top of a star okay. or something? Okay, top of yellow. So let's just start putting these together. Yellow and More yellow. More yellow. Yellow and red. Yellow and red. Yellow. Where's the yellow and red? This one goes. This one. Uh, That's not looking like a picture. We know evil Ophelia. This is all red. Red. Red with some yellow red. on it. Yellow. Yellow. Oh, yellow. Uh, this is yellow. Uh, okay, guys, is anything looking like a picture? Wait, here's a bunch of 
to red and yellow. Guys, okay. I, I red found red. something. What? Oh, those look like they go together. They look pretty similar. But look, look at the other side. Smaller. Oh no, the sides don't match up. Okay, well, here, take the yellow. Uh, look, look at it. If we start with this, at least I feel like this will be easy. Guys, this is so hard. We should have been able to win tic tac toe. Okay, wait, are any of these matching up at all? Okay, wait, guys, maybe we need to start matching up the sides as well. Because if you look here, it's like. Oh, wait. Does this match? No, because it's white on this side. Oh, wait, does that match? It's not yellow on this side. <laughs> <laughs> You're not very good at this. This is hard. Remember, all sides have to match, not just one. Okay, we're still just trying to collect all the yellow sides because I think that's our best bet. It's just working on one side at a time because it's just so complicated, guys. I've never done a puzzle like this that's three-dimensional and you're doing four puzzles at the same time. I don't, how is this the tiebreaker? Maybe you guys aren't smart enough for this. You know what, Ophelia? Maybe we're not, but we'll figure it out. Okay, wait, here's another yellow, here's another red. So this feels like the bottom. Right. That goes there, that goes there. Maybe. Okay. So now, this is kind of making a triangle shape. So do we have one that looks like a triangle? Oh, uh, wait, I saw, I saw that a second ago because I thought it was a star. This? Yes. Right? No. no but I think maybe there's one more piece and then so this. it'll be like the middle of the triangle. Okay. It's just on a short one. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Like that. So then, right. so this. Okay. Oh, wait, there we go. Guys, we're getting some. Look, we actually got a shape. Okay. Smarter than I thought. Okay. Well, let's see if you can get the rest of it. Okay, so now. Wait a second, Gerbo, that looks right. Wait, so like this? Yeah, because the triangle oh. matches yes. right there. Yeah, it does. Oh, okay. Perfect. Wait, is it that one? No, too big. There's oh, a small circle. Okay, nice. great. Right? You guys, yes? Yes, it's a different another, bottom, another, another yellow yeah. piece. How about this one right here? This one? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, so swap so this. Yeah, that matches, that matches! Okay. Okay, good, we're getting somewhere. I must admit, you're getting further than I expected. But, there are still many sides of the puzzle, and you've only done two sides. So let's see how far you actually get. And don't forget, time is ticking! How can we forget that time is ticking? Okay, the nice thing about this is, since we're filling in this side, it's actually getting the other sides too. So it's kind of like a bonus. As we're doing the front, it's getting the left and the right. Then we'll just have to move the back. What about this? That looks like it fits. And then I assume this one, because there's nothing here. So oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yellow. All right, so then maybe this one. Oh my goodness, I have never oh, seen people move so slow in my life. Okay, we're literally almost done. This pattern right here is a swirl, so I can start to see where the lines go together. So there's just two pieces that are missing from this top. Oh boy, oh boy. About two minutes left, and I my brand new form because your sister is never coming back because there's no way that you're winning this challenge in two minutes. Yes, we are! We have two sides done. This side's done. We only have like a handful that of pieces left. Done. Where's the other eye to the smiley? Wait, that's looking good. I'm starting to see the smiley face. Okay, okay. Good. Good. Okay, we almost got it. We almost got it. Okay, hurry, hurry, hurry. Okay, this is actually really satisfying going together. Okay, because I can see that this goes right there. That's the top of the smile. Okay, so it's gonna slide in. Guys, I think we're doing it. Oh, I did it! I, I bought, Okay, go, I go, 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 go. Ten. Wait, ah! okay, get that. Ten, Where's that one go? Eight, seven. Is that it? Okay, push it together. Six, okay, this is where it goes. Five, four, okay, three. Okay, we're in trail. Wait, we're done. Why? We're done. Wait, I think we got it. We did. Look it. Look. It's all, all the sides, everything is done. It's a little lopsided, but you know what? We got like the piece. You get the point. The right. It's all there. It's in the right spot. Now go with our sister back, evil Ophelia. Not no. quite yet. What? We have <laughs> one more challenge to get through. I've had it with Ophelia. When she's back in doll form, I'm sending her to space. That took us so long to do. For our last and final challenge, it will be up to fate. Bye. What does that mean? We're playing a simple game of rock, paper, scissors. What? So the entire fate of whether or not we get our sister back is on rock, paper, scissors, shoe? Good thing I'm a rock, paper, scissors, shoe champion. Choose wisely. Who's gonna do it? I don't know. Cole just said he was a champion. I'll do it. Bye. Wait, don't lose. 
I'm thinking Alpha Vibes from Ophelia, so I'm thinking she's gonna do rock. We don't say that. I, well, I'm going through my prizes, so I should do paper, but she thinks that I know that, so I'm not gonna do that. Then I'm going to do rock, paper, scissors, shoot, scissors! Oh no, you lost, Cole. So what does that mean? Oh, 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 oh my gosh! Did, did a rock just fall from the ceiling? No game of mine comes without a little bit of a twist. Who's next? You will rube the day. Wait. What? It's all making sense. What? I know what I have to do, guys. What do you have to do? Oh, I can't believe I'm gonna do this, but I think it's the only way to save Eden. Guys, I'm so confused right now. I can't believe I'm gonna do this. Guys, give this video a thumbs up for the riskiest decision I've ever made. Okay, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, it looks like oh, I want oh, another oh, round. Oh, oh, scissors! But I wanted to lose so I could get the scissors because I'm gonna do this. I have to get the necklace. Ah! You fool! You fool! How dare you fool me like that! You were supposed to be playing my games, but instead I'm over your tricks. You'll pay for that! Guys, oh, 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 wait, I got the necklace. You got the necklace! I figured I had to use the scissors to cut off the necklace which is why I had to lose. So I think it worked. Wait, but the problem is, where's Eden? Whenever the Eden's been evil before, when she turns back, she's here. And she's not here! But we got the necklace, so what what what, what happened to Eden? She's dead! Wait, who's at the door? Who is that? Oh, no. Wait, Who I think that's that? Gabriella. Wait, no, no, Gabriella? No. Gabriella? Gabriella? Took you long enough. Gabriella? <laughs> Miss me? I didn't miss you. <gasps> That's not Gabriella. I don't know what you did to Gabriella, but you are not her. Hey, scoring family. <laughs> okay, today's mission is to figure out what happened to Gabriella. She went missing last episode, but she came back and I don't know, I don't, she doesn't seem like she's the same. I don't wanna think that's Gabriella. For the one millionth time, I didn't go missing. You guys got so preoccupied with the challenger coming that you didn't realize that Interlock has personalized meetings for all of us, and that's what I went to. Well, well, personalized, personalized meetings? meetings? What does what? that mean? I mean, like, I've seen a couple of them, like maybe on my calendar, but I don't know. I never went to them. I just thought they were one of Interlock's weird things, but I don't know. It feels like Interlock has some sort of grasp on her that, like, is controlling her. We don't even necessarily know if this is Gabrielle, okay? She could be alone for all we know. We have no idea what Interlock is up to with those crazy challengers. Where's Gabrielle's curls? Where's her personality? First of all, it's a rebrand, okay? You could use one. I like this outfit. Your green isn't really your color. Okay, well, my question is, what did user 17834 tell you? Yeah, yes, tell us. That's tell what we wanted to know. That's why you went to VR in the first reason. place. Yeah, tell us what happened in VR. And we can destroy Interlock. You want to know what happened with user 17834? Yeah. Yes. yeah. Nothing. What? It was a scam. I literally got there and this user literally told me nothing. It was a wild goose chase because guess what? what? User 17834 doesn't exist. It was all a ploy to get us not to trust Interlock. Well, Interlock has done nothing but help us become better YouTubers. Guys, this is me right now. What do you mean? I don't know what more you want from me. User 17834 doesn't exist. Guys, what is going on? I don't know what to that believe. is not Gabrielle. No, maybe yes. she's telling the truth. Maybe user 17834 doesn't exist. First of all, not the number. Second of all, that's not Gabrielle. Okay, something is wrong with her. We have to get her back. It's not her sister. And we don't even know if we can trust her or what happened. Trust. Oh, the come money. on, money. The oh, money. Oh. oh. Hey, Hi. Uh, if that's your real name. Uh, we're just gonna. Have a little quick powwow in the other room. Yeah. Sit that in is pow -wow. so weird. Stay there. Oh. Sit tight. <laughs> okay, we have all the money that we have won so far yeah. from the challenger challenges, yeah. and yeah. it's getting up there. We're almost at a million, but right, which we need a million dollars to be able to buy our channel back. But obviously, we can't do anything major without Gabriella, and with her in this crazy state of mind. Hey, we don't know what we're supposed to do. Okay, but I know one thing's for sure is that she could be dangerous if this money is left unattended with her. Yeah, we can't trust her with it out. So let's put it somewhere safe for yeah, right now. Especially because her new personality is all material girl. Exactly. Wait, let's put all this money in this safe. Okay. 
And I feel like we're gonna have to come up with a special password that only the three of us know. We can't tell Gabrielle, we can't even say it in this video in case she goes back and watches maybe, it. Maybe we all come up with a word and then write it on a piece of paper. So you have to have all three of the papers to remember the code. Okay, let's decide on a three letter word, and then we'll all take one of the three letters and then write them down on a piece of paper and hide them so you have to have all three papers to note the code. Okay, so we need a good word, three letters, but something not too obvious, like, uh... Just don't say it out loud. You know. Okay. Well, we have to agree on it. I'm just like spitballing. I'm not saying it's the one. Right, right. Like, guys, right. comment down below what you think is a good three-letter three letter password. But again, it needs to be kind of hard, but nothing too obvious. Okay. What about Tika? Tyler, call in Tika. Or, or uh, Pan. Uh, Pan. Or. Oh, <gasps> I got it. Got it. Shh. Tyler, get in here. Without the camera. Yeah, okay, okay, let's write it down. All right, I'm gonna blur it out so that it doesn't show up on camera, but take each one and fold it up. Yeah, I'm gonna do mine twice. Okay. Okay. Now all we have to do is hide these around the studio. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna put mine right here because it blends in with the oven. Look, it, it legit just looks like it's part of the oven. Okay. okay, so mine is right here. That way, in case we forget the code, we know where they're spread out so that we can come back to it. Okay, I need to find something red. The kitchen's red. Okay, there's a lot of red in the kitchen. Maybe, maybe I can put it right here. <gasps> Ooh, that's a good idea. Okay, okay. I think that's pretty hidden, right? Perfect, yep, okay. I just need a spot for mine. Okay. Wait, where's Gabriella? I don't know where Wasn't she, she right here? Wait, I'm gonna have mine around the neck of the giraffe. Ooh, good. Good idea. All right, so all of the passwords are hidden, and that's just a fail safe in case we forget the password and we need to get into the safe. But hopefully it won't come to that and Gabriella doesn't have to know about the safe. Okay, more importantly, where is Gabriella and how do we turn her back to herself? Oh, Gabriella! I was going for Mr. Moe's be vibes Did you guys get that? Bigger question is, is that actually Gabriella? That's what I want to know. I feel like maybe we should do a DNA test. <gasps> Ooh, like one of those fancy ones where they have the swab and they get the saliva and then technically they can like pull up your heritage. But we don't need to do all that. We just need to figure out if it's actually Gabriella. Okay, just. We need to do a little good cop, bad cop. I'll be the bad cop. Hey. I'll be the good cop. Wait, where is she? She's, 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 okay. Remember, it's rules. <clears throat> I would like to ask you a couple questions. What is it? Wait, are you supposed to be a good cop? Oh, hey, don't be so hard on her. What is happening here? I don't know. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. What? Okay, this um, is so annoying. Okay, okay. First of all, okay, I have a question. Why are you even here if you don't like us? Huh? Uh -huh. Like, why would you come back here if you claim that you don't like us Sorry. and you don't want to be part of our family? Ew, why I is put, there a Q-tip in your ear? They're my... Hater blockers, I can't hear haters. It's supposed to I mean, her mouth. mouth. That's why I have a second. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Answer the question! Oh wait, you're the bad cop. Uh, hey, do me a favor. Don't talk to me. She's mean. We uh, literally have a whole agenda that interlocks and over, and I don't know why I'm the only one who cares about this channel seriously, okay? Yeah. The audience is wanting to see exciting videos from us, and what we were doing was boring. Can you say your vowels real quick? My vowels? Like A E I. Here's a vowel for you. No! <laughs> what are you doing? Even get off. You're so get off. Run. Are you okay? Oh yeah, I'm fine, but I got it. Oh, it recalled back up. See, even her hair doesn't want it to be straight. Uh oh, huh. <gasps> I forgot. Uh, I think it's this one. <laughs> Let's send that to the lab, run some tests, and then see if it's actually Gabrielle. Because I have a feeling that's not actually Gabrielle. I feel like it's some sort of clone. Because we've dealt with clones in the past before, or maybe an evil twin or something. Because that's not Gabrielle. The Gabrielle that I know would be happy and excited, and she loves it's rainbows and colors, just yeah. sparkles she and. Dull stuff. Yeah. That's not her. Uh -huh. Okay, let's put these in the evidence bags, label them, and ship them off. Oh. Why is she in here? I've been giving it some thought. Thought. Okay, thought about and what? you come to your senses and you miss We her? need 
a makeover. A makeover. This room is so boring, and it's boring. honestly a little bit tacky. Wait, this pineapple boring. wall, so last season. Okay, first of all, this room is literally as bright as it can be, it's and we have okay. all of this. I love pineapple. Look at we have all of our amazing. Fan mail are over there. Also, if you guys ever want to send us fan mail, definitely check out our PO box and send us your fan mail because we love to see it. So this room is anything but tacky. If anything is tacky, it's you and that jewelry. It's you, it's you and that jewelry, girl. Mm. I'm not talking about the fan mail. I'm talking about this giant oven, okay? We haven't even had the baker here for literally over a year and we still have it. Why is this not some trendy cafe? Why isn't this something exciting? Honestly, it's just so boring and so dull. I don't even feel like we should film a video in here. This is why we need to listen to Interlock and their contract. They're trying to help elevate us and make us shinier and more exciting and be filled with cool things. First of all, it's okay to be you and like the things that you like. Okay, we don't need Interlock to come in here and tell us what we should and shouldn't she like. She scares me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wait, wait. Okay, Gabrielle loves Starbucks. Yeah, Gabrielle does love Starbucks. Yeah. I mean, you love Starbucks. Why are you Starbucks. talking to me like I'm Elmo? Because maybe it will bring back memories. 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 Of, memories. Yes, memories. Of, of how much you love it. Memories. There's nothing wrong with my memories. That's but I do love Starbucks. Yeah. So let's go. Okay. okay. Um. Guys, I'm thinking we're gonna see what drink she orders once we go to Starbucks. Right, because, because the real I Gabriel, know what she likes to order. The real huh? Gabrielle always orders. Don't say it. All right. Because we have to Wait. test her to see if it's actually okay. her. If she gets a different drink, we'll obviously know that that's not her. Plus, we have the DNA sample that's in work right now, so we just need to see what this shows up. Blah 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 blah. Let's go. Oh, as <laughs> Shahan. <laughs> She whacked my nose. All right, we're in the car driving to Starbucks, but beep, I beep. just had another idea okay. for a test to prove that this is not Gabriella, okay? Hit me with it. So, you know Gabriella, whenever she gets the aux cord, she has to play Taylor Swift. Like, oh, it's annoying it's how much she plays Taylor Swift. Mm. But, being the Swifty that she is, she would obviously pick that as her first choice given the aux. So, I'm going to ask her to play some music on the aux cord, and we'll see what she picks. <clears throat> oh, Gabriella? It's Ella. Ella? She's going all edgy with a nickname? Ugh. Okay, um, <clears throat> Ella, I'm a little bored back here. Could you maybe play some music on the radio? Who listens to the radio? Well, I mean like on the aux cord, like play some music. Fine, I'll play my favorite artist. <gasps> favorite artist, okay. Yeah, that might be her. Tell us who it is. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Why is this music? Who is this? Music. I'm in love. Oh, I hate this. Can you literally turn it off? I'm bleeding. You said you were bored. Okay, I'm no longer bored. Okay, we're at Starbucks. Turn the music off. I'm actually crying. Please stop. That was a lot. Starbucks. Yeah. Okay, guys, we're about to pull up to Starbucks, so this is it, okay? Obviously, the music test proved that I really don't think that this is Gabriella, but I feel like this is Do you think? I don't have ears. I can literally hear everything you were saying. It is me. I just had a rebrand, okay? I am just deciding to stop fighting Interlock because I realized that the user 17834, which is a ploy to distract us and stop us from being amazing. Guys, I refuse to believe that, okay? There was too much information from, from the user for this to just be fake, okay? Interlock did something to Gabrielle. They're brainwashing her to make her forget whatever the user said. I'm convinced of it. All right, Gabrielle, order your Starbucks and show us what you get. Yeah. Hi, um, yeah, can I just get uh, one drink and what do you want? <laughs> What's she gonna order? Hey. I'll do a venti black coffee please black coffee just a black coffee don't you want cream or anything in or it? milk oh, or oh, syrup oh, no. and make it as bitter as you can oh, she would never order such a thing not without the caramel not without the oat milk guys i'm starting to think more and more that it's likely that this isn't Gabriella. No, there's no way. They obviously cloned her, okay? We just need to wait for the DNA sample to come back and prove that this isn't her. And then, how do we get rid of her? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Are you sure um, you like that? Okay, I guess enjoy. <sighs> Fresh. Fresh. Mm. And bitter. Okay, guys. That's so weird. It probably tastes like death and she's enjoying it. Like she's just drinking it. This is not Gabriella. I'm telling 
telling you. Wait, you guys, seriously? Guys? What was oh, that noise? That was my watch. The DNA results just got back and they're at the studio. Oh. The DNA results? Okay, they're back in. We're gonna head back to the studio and look at the DNA results and get the final answer as to whether or not this is actually our sister or if she's been kidnapped and cloned with someone else. Okay, you just sit in here. And you guys go see it that the DNA test says that I'm your sister. Okay, uh, well, uh, just don't leave this room. Yeah. Okay, close the door, close the door. Where am I gonna go? My own house? <sighs> oh right. boy. As long as she stays in there, we'll keep protecting the money. So the results are in? Hey, what is it's it loading, saying? it's floating, it won't load the page. Oh my gosh, it's just the spinning doom sign. Okay, okay, maybe we just have to give it a couple minutes for it to like download the results, yeah. I don't know. Oh, we don't have a couple minutes, okay? I am totally stressing out because this is not Gabriella. Okay, oh, well we wait for the test results, we can keep testing her ourselves. Okay, well we all agree that we think that she's a clone, right? Yeah, yes. obviously. Okay, and we've obviously dealt with clones in the past, so I feel like we have a pretty good idea, but I don't know. this. This test is what we need to seal the deal and tell us whether or not it's a clone or not. Okay, let's go back in there before she gets okay. that. Obviously, if it is a clone, her DNA won't show up the same because even with clones, it's not the exact same DNA. So that's why we need to figure out what this test says. So, what did it say? It didn't load yet. We're still waiting. What do you want me to do? Make the internet go faster? Do you know how to do that? No. This is boring. Uh, you're gonna have to get out! Boring? You're boring. You're literally the definition of boring. If you look uh, up boring in a picture, picture of boring, it'd be a picture, it would of, be a picture of you. Or is this just an album? Wait, she's hungry. This is perfect. Okay, we'll give her two different options for a snack, and then one that we know that the real Gabrielle would like, and one that we know that the fake Ella would like, and we'll see which one she picks. Good idea. There's nothing to. Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. We can make you a snack. Right. Uh, we're good cooks. Yeah, really good cooks. Um, we'll give you two snack options and you can choose from them. One of them the real Gabriel would like and the other one probably Ella would like. So get out of the kitchen. If I get a free snack out of this, I don't care whatever weird plan you're trying to do. I think I have an idea on what we can feed her. Okay, so Gabriel loves these little gummy bunnies and she also loves these crackers. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take them and I'm gonna put hot sauce on them. Gabriel went and touches with a 12 foot pole. Wait, are there no more crackers left? Well, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I got hungry and I've been eating cool. these. We but needed those. It's good enough. More the reason why she won't like it. This better work. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's go feed the beast. <sighs> uh, hey, Gabriel. I mean, hey, Ella. So the rules of uh, this game are you only have one snack here. And I got two for you, so. Okay, which sounds better? The crackers or the gummy rabbits? Let's see, what sounds better? A plate of crumbled up crackers with hot sauce on it or a snack for five year olds? Oh! <sighs> Yum. <laughs> oh, oh, excuse me. Oh. Oh, guys, I'm so confused. This is not getting any easier. Okay. <gasps> Literally, what do I have to do to convince you guys to leave me alone so we can all just go home? I don't know. I'm so conflicted. This just isn't Gabriella, okay? This isn't her lifestyle. This isn't her personality. And why would she just change overnight like that, okay? She's just not adding up. The last thing I can think of is if we give her some tough questions. I mean, we're her siblings after all. We're the people who know her the most more than anybody else. So of course, we should be able to ask her questions that only we would know and only the real Gabriella would be able to answer. To the other room. <sighs> Gabriella! Oh, I'm coming! <gasps> Come on. What is she doing? Okay, you sit in the hot seat. Okay, we're each gonna take one turn asking one question. It's going to be extremely tough. detailed and tough and personal that only Gabrielle would know. It's gonna be the hardest question I've ever asked. Okay, you have a question? I do. All right. Gabrielle, when I was in the third grade, I fell from my bike and scraped my knee. And after you made fun of me for falling, calling me a little baby loser that can't ride a bike, you then helped me up and helped clean me up. What day was this? Literally, what are you talking about? This did not happen. Hmm. Did you have a tricker? I didn't. Right. Didn't happen. All right, let me ask a question about something that actually did happen. Okay. okay. When we were younger, you and I were in Battle of the Books at our library, yeah, yeah, yeah. and 
and something embarrassing happened there at the library. What was it? I threw up in the lobby. I was 12. Get over it. <gasps> oh. Oh. oh, she threw up in the lobby and she's the one who made fun of me for not knowing how to ride a bike. Okay, but that she... didn't happen. Okay, but she did remember that. Yeah, and I don't think that was posted anywhere on the internet. Right, because that's what happened. She threw up. Okay. When we were in France on our family trip, family with Gabriella Scory. The real one. Yeah. The real one who was there. <clears throat> I got pickpocketed on the subway. And what did I do after I got pickpocketed from these two random strangers? You cried like a little baby. Uh, uh, uh oh. Okay, so I did cry, but it was only because I didn't have my phone backed up and I lost my week's worth of what I wore in Paris for my YouTube. Guys, this was not helpful at all. I mean, if anything, this maybe confirms that she is Gabrielle, but I, just I don't, don't know. Get it. You know why the quiz worked? Because it's me, you guys. Literally, I'm just getting so fed up with this, okay? So what? I want to give Interlock a try on how they want us to run our channel. We never actually gave them a true chance. We've been fighting from the beginning. So excuse me for wanting to try a new look, a new style, something different, okay? We've been doing YouTube for 10 years. And the fact that you guys can't trust me and see that this is really me is so hurtful. And honestly, I just don't even know what to think. Now okay, I feel bad. That's not good. Maybe, okay. maybe it is Gabrielle, but it just it doesn't seem like her, okay? It's like she's a clone, but she's not because it's actually her, but something has to be I don't know, controlling her. Wait, that was the test results. The results. What did they say? <gasps> Confirmed. It is Gabriella. Oh guys, no, guys, clone, that was so her mean. DNA. Guys, this does oh. not make sense, okay? Something's not adding up, but what we do know is that that is Gabriella, and we just really hurt We have to feelings. apologize. Yeah, I feel like we need to say sorry. Gabriella! Wait. Maybe, maybe she truly is just going through a rebranding era of herself. Right, I mean, everyone goes change. through different changes. Gabriella, we believe you, okay? We get that you're our sister. Gabriella! We should have believed you from the beginning. We're sorry. Wait, Wait. where'd Wait. she go? Guys? <laughs> No. The safe is open. No, 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 the money. No. It's gone. Wait, it's not here. My paper, it's gone. Wait, how did she get the papers? Oh, the papers. Oh, how did she get them? She Wait. got the password. You guys, this doesn't make sense. How is this Gabriella? She has to be being brainwashed by Interlock. They, they must have some sort of control over her. Her sister, she turned evil and she stole all of our money. There's, There's an, an evil, evil puppet, puppet haunting us. us. Hey, hey story family. <laughs> Okay. In the last episode, we just saw the puppet from the Puppet Master series. If you guys don't know what that is, a while ago, we had been trapped inside of a mansion with someone called the Puppet Master. Well, I mean, technically I was the Puppet Master, but the puppet made me evil. The last time we saw the puppet, it was controlling us, but we just saw him in the last episode and he was controlling himself. Yeah. I'm confused because did he officially come alive? And also not to mention, I definitely heard him talk. Wait, there he is. <sighs> Wait, where did he come from? Okay, he doesn't look alive right now, so who was he actually talking or were we just hallucinating because we broke the rule and went into room number seven, the house was just playing tricks on our mind. Remember the envelope said tricks? Yeah, maybe it's a hologram. Oh! 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 Hello, Scories. Ah. Okay, I am so confused right now. Since when is the puppet able to talk and form sentences? Plus, am I checked? Never. Oh, yes. Uh, I forgot to mention. I'm a little more powerful than the last time you saw me. Okay, so does this mean that you're the puppet master? Oh, boy. Precisely. Huh, wait, how is any of this possible? How does this make sense? You see... I found the mask and decided to put it on because why should I let someone else have all the power? Well then, if you're the puppet master, then who's the billionaire? Yeah. The billionaire? Oh, you mean the toy collector. That's what we call him. He has a liking for strange and mysterious toys. I guess I should be flattered. But the problem with magical toys is that they don't want to be collected. Well, well then what do you want with us? Why can't we leave? Yeah. That's for me to know and you to find out. All you need to know for now is don't break the rules. We'll see you soon. <laughs> Wait, where'd you go? Uh. Okay, what are we supposed to do now that there is a rabid puppet on the loose that can talk? Talk about being freaked out. <gasps> Gabriella? No, no, no. Wait. What happened to Gabriella? 
Our sister, our sister turned into a puppet. Ah! Oh. What happened to Gabriella? Oh no, this must be because we broke one of the rules already. This is what he was talking about when he said that we're gonna regret it or whatever. Look, she's just like being controlled with her smile. She oh my gosh. Oh, guys, this is not good. We have to turn Gabriella back into herself. Hi, guys. <laughs> Do you like my new look? No, how is this possible? I don't know. This was about what the puppet was talking about when we got the note, and it was talking about tricks in the house. Obviously, the puppet has found a way to make his magic stronger and more powerful, so we need to get out of this mansion. Let me make you a snack. No, we don't want a snack. Get real, come Gabriel, back. Gabriel. No, we don't need a snack. Okay, I guess we're going to the kitchen to make a snack. Uh, what are I'll you? I'll make you a snack. A snack? No, we don't want a snack. Uh, ah. oh, wait, there he is. You! I tried to warn you. Now I have full control over your sister since you broke one of the rules. <laughs> oh no. You guys, this is why we shouldn't have broken the rules. I would like to clarify that I was against going in room number seven, okay? If we want to go back and roll the footage, cool, literally just barged in before we could even have a conversation um, about what the consequences could be. And now her sister is a puppet. That's actually kind of funny because the way I remember it, we all walked up into the garage and then I was like, I don't feel like personally we should go in there. And then Eden literally pushed me up against the wall. I was like, if you don't go in there, okay. you are being kicked out of the channel. That's enough. We have bigger problems to fix. Lunch time. Oh, oh, Wait, what is she oh, of? why she move like that? I'm not even gonna lie though. I could use a little snack right now. I'm kind of hungry. I mean, maybe this is just like another challenge that we have to wait out. And once we get to like the end of 24 hours, she'll turn back. Okay, what's on the menu, Gabriella? Turn back? Why would I turn back? I love being a puppet. Uh, no, you don't, Bestie. Okay, she's making spaghetti? Well, okay, I mean, Gabriel just loves spaghetti, so that makes sense. Oh, oh, oh the okay. whole thing is spaghetti? Lunchtime, lunchtime, lunchtime. So I'm confused. Is the puppet master controlling her? I the think so. Or did he just give her... The puppet lunch? master is everything. Well, um, I don't think that's how you cook spaghetti. Huh. I know that's not how you cook spaghetti. Obviously the puppet master is using the strings as a way to establish a connection and control her. If we cut the strings, we cut the connection off of the puppet master. Guys, I have an idea. Where's she going? Where's she? Okay. Just stop moving so I can cut it. Scissors. No scissors. Wait, what is she? Is that whipped cream? I think I'm going to throw up from the snack. Lunch is ready. I have one for each of you. Um, <clears throat> yum. I'm so excited. Ah, uh, this looks interesting. Yeah. What in the buddy and the elf is happening here? Delicious. Mmm. Oh, you got a little. Something. You've got some schmucks on your face. Oh. oh, he's going for it. Okay, I guess if, if this is what we have to do to turn our sister back and get her out of being a puppet, I guess I'll do it too. Not even gonna lie, kind of smacks. Delicious, right? I don't know about this guy. Eat it! You did the whipped cream? Mm -hmm. You did the M&M? <laughs> right? Isn't it weird? Mm. Oh. Time for a show! Oh. Okay. She's leaving. Well, okay. Oh, so. oh yeah, you're going in for more bites? I mean, it's good. It's not bad. That's what I'm saying. What is happening? I don't know. It looks like she's doing some, like, pre-show. Like, she's not actually alive yet, but... But, guys, okay, we need to just get through this show and figure out what we're gonna do because obviously the scissors didn't work to cut Gabriella's yeah. strings off, but that's clearly what we need to do is get those strings off of her, so. Are you guys thinking what do? I'm thinking? What? I was gonna say another another spaghetti ice cream cone. No! Wait, she's starting. Oh. Welcome to the story of the dolls versus the puppets. There once was a family who had a doll 
doll named Ophelia. Wait, uh, th that's us. We have a doll named Ophelia. Wait, what is she talking about? But then there is a puppet who is a master of all. The puppet, the puppet master. master. Yeah, obviously the puppet master. The billionaire tried to collect all these toys to make them his. She's obviously just telling us everything that we went know. Out. Yeah, th th none of this is new. But now the billionaire is gone. Wait, where did the billionaire go? Where did the billionaire, billionaire, billionaire go? He thought he could break the puppet's rules, and then he saw what happened. Okay. Did the, uh, the doll maker... The billionaire? I don't know. Then what happened? And then the puppets took the doll, and they controlled them all. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Question. The end. Time for swimming. Wait. I had a question. Okay, that was the weirdest show I have ever seen, but we need to ask her some questions. Okay, so to the pool? I feel like there was more that we need to find out. Okay, the story was good, but my butt cushion was really good. Okay, well, so what about the billionaire? And, and where did our Ophelia? sister go? Uh, and then you mentioned something about the dolls and the puppets. And I have a lot of questions here. Where, where, where are you going? Wait, Gabriel, we have questions. There, oh, oh, Gabriel, the, the billionaire. Can you answer a couple questions? Why would I answer questions when there's fun to be had? Oh I love God. being a puppet. Someone's gonna have to get in to try and oh, get some information cold. out of her. How is she in here so easily? Probably because she's a puppet, she doesn't feel anything. Uh, I'm not getting in. Puppets feel lots of things. You just feel what the puppeteer wants you to feel. Well, maybe the puppeteer could tell us a little bit more about the dolls versus the puppets. You'll know about the dolls versus the puppets when it's already too late. I'm done swimming! Is that a threat? Oh, oh, okay. That's not like a threat, guys. Um. Oh, oh. Who wants to play Simon Says? That's it, we need to cut these ropes off right now. I'm controlled by my puppeteer, but now you'll be controlled by me. Controlled by her? I mean, it's not like we have strings attached to us, so actually we're not. At least you don't have strings. Yet. What does she mean, yet? <laughs> Simon says to touch your head. What? She's getting really scary. She's getting angry. Touch the head. Okay. Okay. I'm touching the head. Simon says to jump up and down. Okay, guys. We have to jump because I don't know what she means by strings yet. And I don't want strings attached to me. This is crazy. Simon says stop. Simon says put your right hand up in the air. Simon put your right hand down. Pull me up, Simon says lift your hand up. Simon says put both hands up and wave them around. Uh, uh, I need to figure out how to trick her. She's out of control. Simon says, put your hands down. Simon says, put your hands up. Simon says, stop. Wait. You, you just became Simon. Simon. You're not Simon. I'm Simon. I say what to do. Well, not anymore because I'm declaring myself as Simon. Huh? How you like that? <laughs> Like this. <laughs> Maybe that wasn't a good idea. I think I might have been sacrificed. Okay, where did she go? Wait, Paul, what is she doing? Why is she so evil? She always is evil. If you won't listen to me, maybe you'll listen if your doll whoa, whoa, whoa. takes a little bath. No, in the fireplace. No, whoa, 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 whoa. don't let go of hey, guys, Ophelia. Let go of Ophelia, guys. She she out. Out. Let go she of Ophelia. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She's about to throw her in the fireplace. Oh she is out of control. She literally almost took Ophelia and threw her in the fireplace. You need to be stopped. You need to go to your room. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh, oh. Bye. Oh, you guys, whoa, 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 where did the rope just go? Oh, my ankles hurt. Look at you, can, they're like rope burned. Oh, oh. Hey, let me out, let me out. Oh. oh no. You guys, this is bad. This is bad, 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 bad. Puppet Gabrielle is going 
crazy and she traps all of us in, in individual rooms so i'm upstairs um and i need to find a way out i gotta think i gotta think because i have to go rescue everyone because guess who's gonna rescue them if i don't and then we have to we have to stop gabriella and return her back to her form think 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 um that bird gave me an idea okay so obviously this door opens up um so i mean i could theoretically get down from here but it's kind of a long way down and I don't know if I'm wanting broken bones today. Maybe I could I could think of a way to safely lower myself down there. Let me look in the closet if there's anything here. There's an ironing board. That's not gonna help me with anything. There's this long pole that's also not gonna help me with anything. What's in here? Nothing. Wait a second. You guys, I watched this old video when I was a kid on how to get out of a window in case there's ever a fire. You can actually take your bed sheets, tie them together with a square knot, and lower yourself from the second story. So I'm gonna try to do that. So wait, wait, I gotta remember how to do this. Is it this way? Yes. Boom! There's one. Okay, and then I think if I have three together, that'll be plenty long enough. So let me do the same thing with this one. Hey, okay. guys, this is perfect. Look at how long this is. This is all I need to escape. You guys, we're gonna finally stop Gabriella because she's been so crazy and we're just not gonna deal with her anymore and I have to, I have to stop her and go help everyone. So let me go outside here. Oh, 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 wait, the rope. Oh, I got stuck in this rope. Okay. No, no, it's locked. Okay, okay. Uh, this is bad. This is bad. Okay, it seems like Gabrielle has way more power than we thought that she did. She can use ropes to control other people like the puppet is controlling her. Okay, this is new information. We didn't think about this before. Okay, um, um, um. If I can't get out, hopefully someone else is able to get out and then unlock the door from the outside. Eden had Ophelia and sometimes Ophelia has a plan. So all I can do is sit here and then hope, hope that Ophelia and Eden have a plan or Cole comes up with something. Guys, wait, wait, wait. I'm just noticing. There's security cameras all around the house. Look. There's a security camera right out there. There's another one on the front of the house. Why are there so many security cameras around the house? It reminds me so much of Interlock. I feel like is someone's spying. Is this all connected together somehow? I don't know. Hello? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Okay, so I have it all set up. I've got my little eye hook right here. And now I'm just gonna throw everything over here. So windy outside. I don't even know what that noise is I heard. Okay, so there it is. Now, I guess all that's left to do is go over, so wish me luck. <sighs> you guys, I cannot believe that the ropes just picked me up like that and dragged me in here. Okay, what are we going to do? Ophelia, how are we supposed to turn Gabriella back into her sub, okay? We need to get rid of this puppet. Okay, you guys, I'm almost on the floor. I'm just gonna have to jump and oh, 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 oh my gosh. You guys, oh, I did it, I did it. I got out. Okay, so now I have to sneak back into the house and hopefully Gabriella doesn't see me. Gabriella. So far, I don't see Gabriella. So I don't know where she is. I feel like it's only a matter of time before she finds me. So, just give me, wait, there's Tyler. There's Tyler. Oh. Tyler! Oh, oh, you rescued me. Okay, where's Eden and Gabrielle? I don't know, you're the first one I found. Okay, okay, we need to find Eden and Ophelia and figure out. There's also cameras all around the house I just discovered. No way. Yes, outside the window there are cameras and they were pointing outside. Are you serious? Wait, where's Eden? Okay. Eden? She's not in there. Wait. We need to be super quiet because if Gabrielle hears us, she's just gonna send more ropes to send us back upstairs. Okay. This is really tricky because Gabrielle basically has unlimited power to keep us captive. And if she knows that I jumped out of the window, then she's not gonna put me in that room again. 
Let's check the master bedroom again. Okay. She's she's saying to cut the ropes, but we tried. We literally tried cutting the ropes, and then sparks flew everywhere. Wait. She she said that we're cutting that we're cutting the the wrong ropes. Cutting the wrong ropes. Wait, guys. What other ropes am I supposed to cut? Uh, I have only seen the ropes that are hanging from Gabriella, but there must be ropes somewhere else. Ophelia, where are they? Oh my gosh. I need to figure out where Tyler and Cole are. Okay. Uh, you guys, uh, where are Cole and Tyler? Uh, I don't know if I can just walk out back into the living room because that's where crazy Gabriel Puppet was. Uh, wait, wait. You guys, oh my gosh. You guys, I did it. I figured out how we need to stop Gabriella. How? How? Tell us. Ophelia told me that we need to cut the ropes, but we are cutting the wrong ropes. Oh. Which are the right ropes? Follow me. Wait, wait, shh. We just to be so careful because now that Gabriella will know we're out and about. She's obviously gonna come for us. Wait, wait, wait. Are you guys ready for this? Yes. Does someone have scissors? Actually, Tyler does. Oh, there it is. Wait, this um, is how Gabriel's been getting controlled by the puppet master. It's a hybrid between a doll and a puppet, you guys. Uh, he made a doll of her and then turned it into a puppet. That makes sense. That's why he's able to control her. Okay. We have to be fast. Okay, hurry. First day. Oh, <gasps> Ow! It's working. Eden, go. Go, go. 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 Second one. Oh, Wait, it's working. Do it to me. Another one. Oh, oh, oh. Last one. Come on. Are you back to normal? Oh. Gabriel, Gabriel. What's on my hand? Oh, thank goodness she's back, you guys. Okay, but bigger problem. If the puppet master is making dolls of us and turning them into puppets, that means that any of us could be next. <gasps>